Welcome to Game of Pock. I'm Mystic Dan, and this is a show where I play through the history of video games in the order of their release, starting with Super Mario Brothers and the Nintendo. And right now I'm playing Dragon Warrior, and I am in the dungeon of the grave of Garen at Garenham. So I don't know if I really want to go down those stairs right now. Maybe I should. Maybe I shouldn't. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna happen. We're gonna do this. It's gonna happen. We're gonna make this happen. All right, here we go. Let's go downstairs. I was afraid of that. <laughs> All right, let's just pretend that didn't happen. Now, I'm a little bit irritated because I feel like the, like buying new weapons does not seem to be really giving me great... Like, I'm not noticing a huge increase in the damage that I do. It's not super noticeable. I don't know if this is really going to be what I want. And I think the music is slightly changing. Like, it's getting slower or lower in pitch with each level I go down. Ooh, a Wraith Knight. I'm going to cast it asleep just to see. The spell will not work. Okay, that didn't happen. 17, holy crap. This guy hurts. I'm definitely gonna have to heal after this. Wow, this just spiked in difficulty. This is definitely intense. All right, pretty good gains. Um. Yeah, I definitely want to heal after this. And I actually have a couple herbs, so I'll go ahead and use an herb. Yeah. Okay. Spectre. I'm gonna try stop spell. Spectre spell's been blocked. Nice. Probably good. I'm, I'm fighting all sorts of new guys that I haven't seen before. This is an interesting experience. Definitely scary. This lower level is kind of freaking me out a little bit. I want to make sure I have enough health to... Oh, great. To escape out of here. I want to try sleep again, just because... Yeah, good, good, good. Alright, kill him as fast as I can. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Like, even though I, I've leveled up, I've grinded, I've got really good equipment for this point in the game, and I'm in pretty decent shape, I'm still, like, I'm intimidated at this point. Oh yeah, yeah. I think I'm going to... I'm running out of health fast, but I... Or MP. Yeah. Still worth it. Um, <laughs> probably. I might need to come back later. Uh, now that I have a better idea of what's coming. And I may want to use some of the fairy water. I may, maybe, maybe not. Oh, crap. Okay, well I just wasted all this time walking up here. I, I probably should be actually mapping this out. Uh, cause this is definitely intense. Sleep. How much is sleep use? 17 down to 15. So that's good. These aren't taking too much. Both the stop spell and sleep, I think, only take two. So that's not too bad. Unfortunately, I don't know of any items like an ether or something from the later Final Fantasies or whatever that will restore... Or a tincture <laughs> from FF6. That'll restore your MP. A Druin Lord! What do you have to offer? Decent attack. But I killed you, so... Not scary, but decent... Uh, decent gains, drops, I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'll just I'll just kill you, I'm not too worried about this guy. Hurt, yeah, I doubt it'll hurt that much, yeah. The only guys that are really worrying me down here are the uh, Wraith Knights. So those guys really hurt. I bet you I just came down from the wrong place. But maybe if I go up these stairs, I'll be able to go down in a better location. I bet you that's what's gonna happen. A wolf! These guys aren't too bad. They still kinda hurt, but they're not terrible. It's not like 17, like those freaking Wraith Knights. <laughs> Sheesh. Alright, uh, la 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 la. Let's go down here. Yeah, that's exactly what I needed. Warlocks! So these guys aren't bad, except for when they put me to sleep, and even then, it's still not too big of a deal. So, alright. Let's go down these... Well, let me recast Radiant. This will take four, but it shouldn't be too bad. Oh, it's only three. Oh, come on. <laughs> Alright. Um, I think I want to go down these stairs. I really do. Um, so I'll try that first, even though there's some... St well, there's stuff over to the... Just walk over here. 
What's over here? More stairs. Well, now I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'll try these stairs over to the left first. No more battles, please. Ugh, okay. Stairs. And... Yeah, this is definitely a, uh, a confusing dungeon. Oh, I think I'm good. I think I found the... Yeah, the music just slightly changes each time. Take. Fortune that I was found the silver harp. I gotta discard another item? Of course I want the silver harp. Sheesh. Yeah, I'll just ditch the torch. I don't need a torch. Alright. I really hope that that's all I need here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and walk out of here. Just because, why not? I could use the experience. I'm surprised I haven't fought any more, uh, fights. Anyway, uh, I don't really think there's too much more I'm gonna get out of this. Sleep, please fall asleep. Yeah! Surprised at how mostly successful my spells have been. And that's good, I just wish- For me, it always seems like when I- So I'm, I'm typically more of a- Oh, nice, he healed. Typically in games, I like the more melee type of characters. Um, I like to just kind of throw myself into the fray and attack and just kind of... So, melee slash tank, meaning I I don't want to worry too much about uh, dodging, because I'm not very good at like dodging and blocking and stuff like that. Um, it's probably a skill I just need to develop anyway. <laughs> but this, typically speaking, that's the way I play. Um, I like to just kind of throw myself in there and wreck shop and... Worry more about trying to kill him as fast as I can, and not worry so much about avoiding hits because, uh, you know, otherwise I'll die from a single hit or two, but... Ah, oh, stop healing! Crying out loud! I, what sucks about that is I don't know how much they're healing. Stop healing! <laughs> Piece of crap! Okay. Alright, time for an herb. Herb. Okay, time for another herb. <laughs> This isn't going well. Ten, and I'll just see if I can kill it. Okay, good. Sheesh. I probably should just get out of here. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and outside. Just because I'm low on herbs and low on MP. There we go. Outside the dungeon. Now, what exactly does the harp do? That's my real question at this point. <laughs> Do I have enough to just go straight back home? Also, how many keys do I have left? I've got three, so I'm okay. Uh, let's see if I can return. Just... Too low, that's good to know. I probably need at least five. I'll get home and I'll restore my MP and I will see how many it takes. So that's the thing that's just frustrating about this game in particular, since it was just the first of its kind, and there was a lot of stuff that it really didn't think about, and that it didn't really do right, in my opinion. Like, seeing how much something heals when they heal themselves, or, um, not knowing how much MP a spell is gonna take to use it, or even what it does! <sighs> Excuse me. Or being able to look at an item or a spell before trying to use it, you know? Because if I do status and I just... Yeah, I can't even... yeah, so... Um, in later games, they just kind of... they understood that you're gonna want to take a look at your spells, your different kinds of attacks, your equipment, your items. You're gonna want to look at those and see what they do. Um... And how much they cost or whatever before you actually try to use them. 59? Yeah, that's my max. So I'm gonna try... return. 59... down to... wow, that's 8! That's expensive. Alright, that's good to know. Um, and now that I've got that, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up and save. And I'm gonna work over to the west, because I want to go in that cave that's over there. I saw a long time ago. Uh, am I full on... Yeah, I'm fully healed. That's good. Oh, I've been walking around, so that's probably what did it. That's what's so nice about the magic arm, is just walking. <laughs> Walking by itself will really help me out. So, I've, I've gotten a lot of important stuff, so that's great. 
I'm greatly pleased that thou hast returned, Mystic. Before reaching thy next level of experience, thou must gain 952 points. So I've got uh, just under a thousand experience to go before I level up again. Definitely takes longer and longer and longer to level up the more you play this. So, alright, so let's see. I really wish I had a transport spell. That's something that kills me. Um, you, you can only save in one location in the whole game, and that doesn't even heal you. So you have to spend money or go here to do the restore each MP, heal, restore MP, heal, or whatever. And there's no warping to towns, unless that's a spell I'm just gonna get later. So we'll see, I'm gonna head over here and head south, uh, before I continue on. Um... Just to take a look, I should be fine surviving pretty much anything I'm gonna run into at this point. Um, so I wanna explore that cave, and I want to... Oh, I should've bought some herbs. Just to have them, I might be okay, I might need some extra keys too. I'll just- I'll warp home if I find that I'm needing anything. I should be alright. Normally, it's- it's a really good idea to make sure that you're as prepared as you should be before you head out to explore a new region and go a new place that you haven't really been to before. So now I'm crossing this bridge. Over to the right, it's just a dead end. There's nothing over there. Um, and then down here, I explored over this area just a little bit when I was grinding just to kind of find some stronger enemies to grind against, and, uh, I ended up finding the path over here to that cave that I saw in either the first or second episode and I was like, ooh, that's tantalizing. <laughs> so, uh, I'll show you that in just a moment. Now, the, the unfortunate thing about the really wordy, uh, biblical English dialogue of this is that the battles are slowed down significantly because it just takes so much time to load so much of that text. Um, it's not like flying through battles if you need to isn't really as fast as it would it, it would be nice to be. But anyway, so here's this cave. I am going to cast Radiant, and I'm pretty sure this is a fairly easy cave, but uh, yeah, just a druid. This shouldn't be too big of a deal. Then again, the other, the Grave of Garen, got significantly harder when I went in lower levels. So, anyway, I will save that experience for the next episode. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause this, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for checking out Game of Pock. This is Mystic Dan signing out. Bye.